This is the Houston National Cemetery. So we see the different rates which are which are laid here. This is Mayor Sylvester Turner comparing with uh, some of the Houstonians here in this event. <laughs> All right, brother, how you doing? Good. Good. So we are back celebrating Memorial Day yes, after almost two years of COVID interruption. Yes. What are your feelings and impressions and emotions? Man, I, I am super excited. Uh, we have all kinds of dignitaries here from the city, congressmen, uh, and everybody's here. So I'm excited to get back to the community, to the veteran community. This is a very special day. We're going to make sure that the families who lost their loved ones, I lost two of my buddies in combat, so I know what they feel. So I want to make sure that I'm here to support them. Sir, uh, you are a black gentleman in a very uh, conservative, military way. Yes, sir. The Buffalo killings, the Uvalde killings are all done by guns and guns are used by military, soldiers and police. What advice do you have to the community that is grieving and to the people out there? Just a little bit of gun control. I, I never used a gun because I was in the Air Force and a Florida airplane, but I did support the war. But guns, yeah, they, uh, I wish they would get rid of them. Yeah, I have no use for them. So we are returning to uh, the memorial service in person. What are your impressions, what emotions, what message do you have to your fellow Houstonians? Well, just that I think that I understand why some guys don't come out to support it. Because they did, they also lost friends and they were actually on ground in the war. And it just, you know, it brings back too many old memories for them. So they, they really don't support them. Uh, what's your name? Yeah, you're, you're in which part of the military? Oh, really? Have you lost anybody in the war or any war? Uh, I know, like, from my unit, I have one person that I lost. Oh, really? It was last year, February. February. So, what message do you have to the grieving families who lost people in uh, wars and battle? I just want to show I they did their honor for the family and then we always have their friends and family, also family and then we also like we never forget them who they serve with us so that and their, uh, their power that for our country. There is presently the issue of gun control with the killing of the children at the Rupp Elementary School in Uvadi. So you use guns, or soldiers use guns, police use guns. So what is your impression, what is your position about this issue of gun control and gun killings and everything? I feel that uh, people have to have more training on, gun, on using guns, how to carry them, and then more deep into security Bay country. Like us in the military, yeah. we do a lot of training like every day as a Marine Corps. We do training like shooting every day, so how to handle, how to basically check out your effect on the guns. And then if there's problems or like that, they have to be solved by his family member. Thank you. Okay.